Hello friends and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how I use chalk paint on this IKEA bookshelf. It's a green color you can see. My daughter want pink color so I'm going to use pink chalk paint. Over you don't have to sand the furniture but if you want you can sand it. And you can see how I'm using the brush because chalk paint dries very fast. And it depends which color you are using. I'm using Martha Stewart chalk paint here. It's very easy to work with. So I don't want to see the brush stoke, so I'm just dabbing it. You can use a brush straight in one direction, and then wherever you see stoke and you want to hide it, you just dab over. You can see like this. You can also use sponge. But I think with the brush is very easy and faster. The chalk color is little thick, so I'm gonna spray water. So when you use the water, it will become smoother and easy to work with. So I'm just gonna use the same technique. I'm using gift wrapping paper. I already cut it out by the size. And I'm gonna apply Mod Podge glue. If you do not have Mod Podge glue, you can use regular glue. Add one fourth part of water and mix well. And you can use that one as well. going to use a gift card to remove all bubbles you just press very gently so it sticks on the furniture when you are using gift wrapping paper you just apply glue in a small part I'm gonna use sanding paper to remove excess paper from the furniture. Just scrub very gently near the edge, it will remove the excess paper by itself, and you will have that clean edge. Now I'm using flower stencils and I use acrylic color and I mix little gesso just to make thick colors so it won't come out from the stencils. I don't know why but I removed the stencils between two flower and this is how it look now. Let me know which one you like better in the comment section below. After completely dried use your choice of 
फर्नीचर वैक्स वार्निश और मॉट पॉच जस्ट टू प्रोटेक्ट द कलर थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग सी यू नेक्स्ट टाइम